Today we're going to talk about the one 1875 Tyee Limited. Uh, this is a boat that's special for them this year. Um, every year they have a limited package, and so this is what this one is. We'll start with the trailer. First of all, we have all our trailers custom built. We don't do any stock trailers. We have surge brakes on this one. We also have upgraded tongue jack and upgraded winch. We don't mess around with any of that stuff. We have LED lights. As you can tell, we have custom matching paint and pinstripes, so it kind of ties everything all together. This is a tandem axle trailer, so it's a 5,000 pound rated trailer, which is more than enough weight to carry this package. We have tandem axle wheels with aluminum wheels. We have large step pads front and rear. It makes it easy to stand up here and get in the boat or look inside the boat, rather than plastic fenders, which are either can be slick uh, getting up on there or they collapse under the weight of these 50 feet up there in general. As we work our way to the back, one of the things that you'll be able to see here is we have our tail lights, but what you can't, may not be able to notice until you hook it up, this is reverse light. So we put reverse lights on all our trailers so that when you put it in reverse, it actually lights up behind you so that in the evenings or in the dark, you can actually see what you're backing into so you're not running into garage doors or things along those lines. We also have the ratchet strap, as you can see right here. And then we have four welded bunks that are precisely placed to support the boat in the right locations so that it makes it comfortable for the, actually comfortable for the boat to set on. So it's not beating on the rivets or beating on the bottom. This beautiful package is powered by a Mercury 200 horsepower Pro XS. Now this is the V8 version of the 200. They make a V6 and a V8. Not that one's better than the other, but this is the V8. It's got plenty of power, plenty of torque. As we get ready to move up in this, I will show you that this does have a boarding ladder back here. It is required by the Coast Guard now to have an emergency way to get in. So if you're going to put an emergency ladder on there, you might, have put a, might as well put a ladder that actually serves a purpose. So this will allow you to get in and out during the summer when you want to go swimming or if you do just want to cool off. As we get in here, the first thing you're going to see is, is when you look down is the beautiful sea, uh, marine mat flooring here. What the marine mat flooring does is that it is a high density foam that's cut into smaller pieces. They in and out, but it's designed to get dirty, bloody, wet, whatever, but you can take it out, hose it off, and it doesn't do any damage to it. It helps protect the bottom of the boat, or the bottom of the floor here, the cockpit area, so you're not always right, dry and walking on your vinyl. As we get down in here, these seats are all power assist seats, so they're what they're called air ride. Air ride gives us the ability that when you hit a wave, it bounces just a little bit, so it takes some of the beating off of your back. It also helps with the seats. Then we come to the good seat, the captain's seat. This seat pivots in all directions, and it's what they call a suspension seat. And with the suspension seat on the front here, you actually dial your weight in whatever that might be, and then it adjusts for it so it knows how much to give and take when you're on the water with rougher water. This package does have power steering on it. This has the Panther Assist, so not only does it have hydraulic, but it has Panther power steering as well too. Smart craft gauges allow us to control some of the motor functions from the gauge itself, and they're all digital. It's got a built-in Helix 7. It's got a Rockford Fosgate stereo system. It is set up, which we did not add it in there, but it is set up to cook, add a kicker motor to it. Kicker motor controls would go in this location right here, run down through the panel, and then we can add it on the back side. As we move to the front, we have a Helix 10 for the front fish locator, and we have a Tarova 80, excuse me, a Tarova 112, iPilot MDI. 
So this, pack, this package will do everything you want it to do. It's not only fishing, but it is a lot of family. And I'm going to show you one more aspect to it before we close this video out. The large live well back here, which this is what the fishing boat is, the large live well, but it has the aft flip seats. And this, was, this is what makes it a family boat. So for the guy that wants to go fishing on Lake Erie, Lake Michigan, on that one weekend, but on the next weekend you have to take everybody tubing and skiing, you have the ability to do that. The center location right here is for the ski pole, which this pond, this boat does have the ski pole on it. It's just down here below, hidden right here. If you have any questions, please contact Lake Drive Marine. You can find us on the web at www.lakedrivemarine.com or 517-238-4651.